What's up guys, Andrew Keeley from Covers back at you for yet another Thursday night classic. And of course I'm lying to you because it is the Jacksonville Jaguars visiting the Cincinnati Bengals this week. Uh, but to be fair, I am looking forward to seeing Joe Burrow and Trevor Lawrence face off in prime time. And since we're going to be watching it, let's try to win some bets while we're at it. The Bengals, a seven-point favorites for this matchup. Not really that surprising considering their 2 and one start. Uh, coming off a solid win over rival Pittsburgh in Pittsburgh. Burrow has looked good at this point. The questions about Jamar Chase's drops have all gone away after four touchdowns in his first three games. But the biggest thing to like about this Bengals team right now is the improvement of the defense. They right now are ranked fourth in DVOA after ranking 27th a year ago. So huge, huge strides made there. But really, this bet is all about fading the Jacksonville Jaguars. They're about as big of a dumpster fire as the team can be after three weeks, 0-3 straight up and against the spread. They have a head coach in Urban Meyer who seems disinterested, is already fielding questions about a USC job, and just doesn't have to have his, seem to have his team prepared on a week-to-week -week basis. And unfortunately, they are throwing Trevor Lawrence to the Wolves. The offensive line play is sketchy, the play calling is bad, and he's been making some rookie mistakes as well, forcing some throws, resulting in a ton of turnovers. I don't love the line of Bengals minus seven, but I am leaning towards that way because I just can't put any faith in backing this Jaguars team in its current state. And I think the uh, Bengals weapons will overtake the Jags at one point and get the cover here. Uh, speaking of turnovers for Lawrence, his interception uh, total for this game is set at one and a half, which is interesting because most pick uh, over under pick totals are set at 0 0.5 but Lawrence has seven interceptions through his first three games, two, at least two in each game, and now goes against the Bengals defense that it ranks third in interception and fourth in sack rate, so they'll probably force some more bad throws. I'm hoping Trevor Lawrence has some better days in his future, but we're gonna take the over one and a half picks here. You can find that between about plus 130 and plus 150 on your books. So for even more picks and analysis for this game, head on over to covers.com, and as always, follow us on Twitter, at covers.